Community Action, we provide uh, services to members of our community who are in really tough situations. For some people, when they come to see us at Community Action, they're in the middle of their worst day. I think back to my worst day ever, and I reflect on what it took for me to survive that. If it weren't for the help and the support that I got from my friends and family, I don't know what my life would be like today. There's a lot of people out there who don't have a support system or whose support system can't help them when they need it. And so that's why I believe in the work that we do because I believe that everybody deserves an opportunity or a hand if they need it to dig themselves out and get back on their feet. It's my hope that when people leave Community Action that their worst day ever is just a little bit more bearable and that they have some more hope for their future. And so I'm thankful that in some small way, I get to be a part of that. There was a moment in our office a few years back that a gentleman came in and he was suffering from cancer, from Agent Orange exposure in Vietnam and he was going through chemo at the time. And during that chemo, it had um, hurt his teeth so bad that they had to stop for fear of having infections. At that point, he was pretty close to not being able to beat this cancer. In this office, I was able to set up to get all of his teeth pulled out and with the county's help to get dentures put in so that he can continue that uh, chemo. And still to this day, five years later, that man is alive and calls me. I was disabled in the military. I was in a training accident. Uh, after 9-11 happened, we were getting ready to deploy. This caused me to have to leave the military on a medical discharge. When I first uh, left the military um, being injured and being dropped out, a uh, individual, 18-year-old kid came in to take my spot. And two weeks after I got home, I found out my entire team got hit. And they lost this kid who took my spot and I was supposed to be with them. Every single day, I, I have woken up every day the 10 years I've worked here, and I've been happy to come to work, and I've come with a smile, because I change lives and help my brothers and sisters every single day. I do what I do so that I can affect change. Even if it's change in a small way, I want to know every day that I've done something that's going to improve the life of someone within the county. My why is to use the communication skills I have to convey to people the importance of what they do because everyone at the county makes a contribution and it's important for people to feel that, to feel valued and to know that what you do does make a difference. And if I can communicate that to people, if I can bring people together, if I can make sure that someone feels heard, that's important to me, that's part of my why. We all have a part to play, and it's important that we embrace that part and that we do our best because we're working on behalf of the taxpayers in Kent County, and it's a privilege. Mm -hmm.